So what we have here in the background is our Scan Eagle model. Now the Scan Eagle was designed in the late 90s for operations off tuna, fo tuna uh, boat vessels, um, really to hunt tuna and watch out for dolphin populations from an environmental standpoint. But we saw a genesis and the ability to change that and migrate it over to the military domain um, for launch and recovering off not just ships but also in restricted and constrained areas. Its uniqueness is that it has a pneumatic catapult launcher and has what is called the skyhook technology for its recovery system, which is where the aircraft captures on a wing hook uh, on a nylon cord which is, to hang, which is hung from a, a 50 foot mast. Now the, the beauty of the system is that it will last for 24 hours at a time in, uh, in the air and uh, has a range of different sensor payload capabilities which really uses best of class technologies uh, to enhance the way uh, in which we provide intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance on the battlefield. And more uniquely is that we're also looking at its benefits and opportunities outside the military domain and really transitioning it into commercial markets as well uh, for use in mining, uh, in emergency services management uh, and in a range of different uh, energy sectors for pipeline and other surveillance requirements. The Scan Eagle, I think, is a very uh, capable system and would be highly suited to the, the Indian marketplace. Uh, primarily its ability to be used in very small footprint areas, um, whether it be mountainous regions, jungle areas, out in the remote areas of desert. Uh, the ability for it to take up so little room with its pneumatic um, catapult and its skyhook technology means that um, it's easy to get into those areas, it's mobile enough so that it can be operated by a small team on the ground, um, it's a very, very reliable system which is highly suited to the type of operations that would be needed here both in the Army as well as in potentially Navy operations where the system can be embarked on, on warships to provide the local commander on that ship extra surveillance capability over the horizon that he would not normally um, have and also persistent surveillance that he wouldn't otherwise get from a rotary wing platform or a manned rotary wing platform on the deck.